girl, I get it Hate the lifestyle that I'm living I'm just tryna show you something different Up, up the judge, let's get lifted Let's get lifted you already know what time it is. Big CEO cash out in the building, man. AKA cash out. Mike, you dig me? But look, man, I make sure y'all just about to. I'm about to just explain to y'all why NBA 2K doesn't do anything for 21 next gen when it comes to park or pro am, things like that. The city, they, I'm here to tell y'all, bro, they straight up just don't care anymore. And there's one reason for that, you feel me? This is the reason right here. This is the first thing you see when you load up NBA 2K21 on next gen. You see something about my team literally every single time, bro. You feel me? Now, when you load up my team, it's a lot of stuff, you feel me? Um, correct me if I'm wrong, but I think my team might be like at a very high point right now. Like this might be the best my team that 2K has done in a very long time, you know? Like they just have so much content, really good packs. Um, I don't know how the pack arts are, but any pack I've opened was actually pretty good. Like these packs right here, pretty good. Y'all see how much they cost? This is what's making 2K their money. Not park, not any of that. Tr uh, micro transactions through my team. That's what's making the bread for NBA 2K, man. And that's why they care about this mode so much. And that's why they constantly update and try to make this mode as fresh as possible. You feel me? Look at the VC prices. People are buying tons and, v tons and tons of VC every day to purchase packs. They're making hella money because without a good team, you can't win games. It doesn't matter your skill level because you can have any pink diamond, whatever car. You could throw up any shot and it's in there. You feel me? Just throw it up. Bam. You made it. It doesn't matter your skill level. It's all about the rarity of your cards. You feel me? So this is why people are buying lots and lots of VC for packs on my team. Now, if we go through all the patches that have been on next gen, there have been five total. The most important ones, right, that actually affected us was probably patch one, two, and three. That's about it. Patch one fixed the choppiness. Patch two fixed, um, I think the nerf they nerfed the fading or something like that and patch three basically nerfed uh special delivery is either patch three or patch four they nerfed special delivery and hot shot basically 2k said we were having way too much fun getting our takeover super quick so they patched it basically you feel me but they didn't patch the sliding on defense they didn't patch the inbounds like you know steals because it's way too easy to inbound steal they didn't patch the glitch courts getting stuck on the courts or any of that they didn't patch any like other major problem that we have been voicing out upon they haven't patched those you feel me um i don't know what is going on with them i don't know why they won't listen to anything we have to say because i feel like the better the game is for us the more we are gonna enjoy it the more viewerships will go up, the more money will make off you'll make off of our transactions. Cause I mean, who honestly wants to spend money on a brand new character for this bum ass game? Like, come on, dog. Who wants to spend money on on clothes for a game that's just terrible? You know what I'm saying? Like, people are spending their money on my team because my team is actually a good game mode. You feel me? If you look here, these are the facts. And this was from May 20th of 2020. Just last year, someone made this article. Now, 2K made 410 million at the end of the quarter off of microtransactions, bro. 2K20 made more money in microtransactions than GTA Online, bro. And you know, GTA has been the biggest game out for the longest time, you know? So the fact that they made more money than GTA is insane. You know what I'm saying? 2k20 off of microtransactions and i'm pretty sure most of those were my team dog my team is the money maker for 2k take two interactives relies heavily on microtransactions and 2k is probably like their number one game for that you feel me because we spend so much money on my team on buying vc for our players upgrades all type of stuff 
So we put a lot of money into 2K's pockets, which is why it's crazy how they don't listen to us at all and don't fix the issues that we need fixing. Because if I'm being real with you, 2K21 next gen could have, it had the pop, they had the, uh, what was the word for that? The potential. It had the potential to be one of the best 2Ks we've had since 16. Most definitely this game had that potential, but it just lost it all because they didn't want to listen to us. They didn't want to fix the game. And the game just, it came out bad in the first place, but they easily could have fixed it and made it a great game. But like, I don't know. They just choose not to listen to us at all. And the viewership is ass. Nobody wants to watch Next Gen at all. One thing that really made that a problem was that we couldn't get our hands on Next Gen consoles. You feel me? A lot of people couldn't get their hands on a Next Gen PlayStation 5 or Xbox Series X. You feel me? This was the biggest issue. But the reason why current gen stayed popping is because 2K wasn't doing anything with next gen. They weren't doing anything significant with, with next gen park or whatever to make people want to come play this because my team is the same for both next gen and current gen. So there would be no need for you to upgrade a current gen just for my team. You feel me? It's the city and they didn't do anything significant especially the gameplay wise that would make you want to do this everybody would rather just go to current gen and just speed boost and zen up and just go crazy you feel me then play this next gen shit and just get dunked on over and over again because that's all that happens now if we take a look at the views on twitch dog our viewership is really low you feel me now out of the views that we do get most of those are current gen okay if you take a good look most of those are all current gen you know what i'm saying it's not a lot of people getting views on next gen at all because next gen is just it's not appealing at all nobody wants to see people dunking on somebody 24 7 nobody wants to see just trash gameplay like that's what's wrong with this game trash gameplay but that they won't fix trash gameplay they won't fix and the reason why is because we don't make money for them my team does so all they worry about is my team look at the other game modes the the my the WNBA stuff nobody even touches that mode bro they don't care about that mode themselves look at my gm my nba or whatever they don't do anything with that game mode it's been the same for a couple years now they don't care all they care about is just my team my team is making bread bro that's all they care about if we're not putting money in their pockets they don't give up they don't give a damn dude so honestly if you're like waiting for something to happen there, nothing is gonna happen bro they're not gonna fix next gen at all your only hope is to hope that like 2k22 will be good but then again it's not gonna be you know you just gotta have your expectations low bro i'm telling you right now you just have to have your expectations low because 2k is only concerned about the money you know what i'm saying they know my team is gonna be a hit year after year and i don't know dog it, it, it's, it's just not looking good with the way things are going it's not looking good for 2k22 at all because if that gameplay isn't fire off the rip it's basically a done deal basically because you know they're not going to put in the time and the effort to fix it why do all that when they still making all their bread with how the game is now they don't care they're just going to keep making their bread and we're going to keep playing a trash game bro it's just that's just how it is right now man and it's really sad bro something most definitely has to be done but what can we do you feel me they like our voices just aren't heard at all you know people want to be mayor so bad mayors have no influence over the game at all you feel me a mayor can say what he wants but 2k will never listen dog but that's really all i got man i'm telling y'all these microtransactions in my team is the reason why they update my team so much and don't really touch park at all because Apparently, we're not making them enough money, so they don't care. You feel me? Like Michael Jackson said, all I want to say is that they don't really care about us. Ooh, 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 ooh. You feel me? They don't care, bro. If y'all enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like, bro. Share the video. Subscribe. You feel me? If you're new to the channel, I appreciate every one of y'all that watched this video. And I'm out, bro. Peace.